Don't tell Malachi. Would you like a full demo with that movie? Yeah. Say, would you like a full demo? Sure. So this was the earliest. You would have cut this by hand. The, the stock is on the hard side. Okay? But if you cut it all up, no different, you cut your steak on your plate, smash your potatoes, then you'll eat it all. Okay? So it is... It is like soft and spongy inside. So this was the earliest way they would have cut it. So the next step up was the machine here. This is a, a big knife in here like a paper cutter. And then it comes up and hits the stop. But now you're feeding it by hand. And slicing it off. Called a lever cutter. What was your name, sir? Laverne Schmitz. Laverne Schmitz. Uh, from Richfield. Richfield. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Where are you from? Madison. Madison. Yes. Right. Sandra and Ricky. Alright. So this is the next step up. Now you had a hand crank and there's feed rollers here that are feeding it in, so you didn't have to feed it. There's a ratchet on this side you can set for the length of the cut. Uh, to come over here. You can see this has sickle blades that are doing the cutting. So it's slicing it off. It's similar to what you were doing back there, the up and down motion. That one listed in the 1893-94 catalog. Huh. Wow. For six dollars and fifty cents. Six dollars and fifty cents. Yeah. And then you had to go home and think about it. Yet. Yeah. Yeah. It's a big purchase. Yeah. It's a lot of money. Or that's actually just yeah. That machine over there was six fifty. This machine here was uh, eighteen dollars. So. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's an upgrade. Yeah. Oh boy. So then we have this one here. This has two knives inside there. They're the, what they call a rotary knife. You can't really see them in there, but they're doing the cutting. You want to turn the crank on there? Winder up. Champion feed cutter was built in uh, Indiana, and uh, International Harvester bought them out in 1904. So this is prior to 1904. Wow. So. Oh, fantastic. And we have this one here was built in Mayville. So you had run a top through, you felt how much work it took, and this one's got two tops on it. It's all automatic, I mean, belt power feed. How long have you had these machines? Uh, the, the last machine, I've had various years. The last machine I've had the last three years, I'd say four years. This one I've had about 10 or 12 years. This one I've had four years. But I got a one similar to this that I've had for like 20 years. I put them all on the wheels and 
Thank you so much. These are beautiful, they really are. 